All right, hello again. Uh, it's been a few days. I don't even remember exactly where I was. I think I just beat the Flexile Sentry. I guess I could check my uploaded videos to see. <laughs> uh, I think we're the Lost Bastille. Or, we got there. Let's see. Adaptability, I suppose, at some point. Let's see. I don't want to do the last one steal yet. Let's go back to Hate's Tower of Flame. Also, this is, uh, let's play Dark Souls 2, obviously. I... <laughs> I had a couple days off, and then I just decided not to work on it, because, well, it's more of a hobby. I don't really have much of a viewership, and, well, sorry to anyone who was waiting for this. I, uh... I think that most people who view my videos, other than a couple of friends, uh, don't really, you know, intentionally come and watch me. It's like, well, I'll see how, you know, like, it's like a curiosity more than it is a, uh, I had gone... to, uh... the Forest of Fallen Giants first, which is like the intended first area, probably, probably, wouldn't be suffering quite so much, but I don't, because I'm touched. No more touches than these enemies I'm fighting though, huh? Although, to be perfectly frank, I, I think this is the first time I've tried not going to the Forest of Fallen Giants. I probably should have stuck with what I know. Of course, if I was doing that, I uh, wouldn't be playing Dark Souls 2. So, you know. There's that. Hello, gents. I, uh, heard you were having a party. Okay. interest in me, Frank. I can change, I swear. I, I totally wasn't trying to lead you to your death. Dude, he is like, booking it. He's just like, fuck this, I'm not walking off a cliff.
real way to fight multiple opponents in these games. Hit and run. I suppose coming over here is completely optional as well, like, uh... I don't think there's actually any... driven reason, reason to come over here like it's not on the path really it's just sort of a, a place you can go oh dear <laughs> I almost did that I almost did that oh hey it worked out it worked out now let's see that's a healing item that's also a healing item. Ah oh, man, he's waking up. And I'm like over here casting a miracle. Ugh. Go back to sleep, Mr. Dragon. I want to sneak up on you while you are down. Although I don't think that's possible now. Maybe if I quit, quit out and come back? Apparently no. Very well. I will accept this trial. Okay, maybe I won't accept this trial. Uh, I'll just... Uh, Yes, yes, game. We know where we are. At least now we do. Dragon goes back to sleep. All right. So either I just gotta play skillfully enough to get past everything into that dragon, or I'm gonna kill everything so many times that it goes away. by now. The Heidi Knight swing 
is act like the arc. The whole arc is like an active hitbox before he even actually starts swinging. Ow! Jeez, dude. If I'd gone to the Forest of Fallen Giants, I would have some sort of better weapon. Yeah. Take that discount so away. Okay. Let's see. I'd be talking more, it's just well what I'm doing isn't exactly um uh, noteworthy, I guess. Of course <laughs> implying that any part of my let's play is noteworthy. a good life. Yeah. I was good at Dark Souls 2 once. Nah, not really. Sort of? I don't know. I've got good fundamentals. <laughs> nah, nah, I don't. <laughs> yeah. I've lost track of how long I've been recording, too. Ugh. 
basically just a stay sand shit at this point. I probably should have just done this for like however long I've been recording at this point. What, like 15, 20 minutes or something? Probably should have just done this off screen and said, hey, I cleared all these enemies off screen. I did that a lot in my Dark Souls 1 Let's Play. Like, I did all sorts of farming and like. these guys didn't come out in pairs. Also, I'm pretty sure these giant green guys, as far as enemy placement goes, I don't think they were changed from the original Dark Souls 2. this in or to not leave this in. Well. I suppose it'll be how far I make it before recording stops. If I can make it to and kill the dragon before the recording stops, well one, that would be a miracle, and two, That would be actual progress. Knight that the Heidi Knights have kind of reminds me of an attack from a Sekiro boss for some reason. Mm -hmm. 
Nighty night leggings, huh? I prefer the body because you get a sweet tattered cape. Arise, chicken! Arise! You know you want to attack me right here. Totally just... Ah, oh, well you didn't fall for it. Well. Yes, he said... That he's tired of my shenanigans. I always think the uh, the challenge runs people do are mildly interesting. Like not just speed runs, but like there's all those runs for like Dark Souls 3. I think this game and the first one as well, where it's like beat the game without rolling and without shield use, you know, and then like no sprinting. You know, like, just... You find all the gaps in the attack patterns where with just like normal walking speed you don't get hit or whatever. Like I guess like the dead space in their uh pattern more or less. Two-handed sword guys, like you're on your own. Inputs are both interesting and also annoying. I know it's to discourage button mashing, but when you're nervous, they're like, you got fat fingers. It's really, really annoying. I wonder why so many people are active online. Take those. Uh Sword ones really aren't that hard to tear up if you can stagger them. Of course, that goes for a lot of enemies in this game and in any Souls game. If you can stagger it, you know, that gives you a lot of breathing room. I gotta be getting close to time. <laughs> Dude, he's still hitting me. 
Oh boy. Stop using this in there for a second. Use it all, use it all, Scotty. Giant, but with wings. Okay. Fire breath. An angry fire breath. Oh dear. I don't know how far out that goes. It looks disastrously large. I think I've almost got it. Hell yeah! Petrified Dragon Bone and the Watch Dragon Karma. Huh? What's this? A shield decorated by intertwined dragons. The black and white contrast depicts the ebb and flow of the fate of all li things living, and the serpentine dragons that watch over the march of time. The bearer of the shield will be blessed by great fortune in battle. It's got a 90% physical block, and a bunch of other pretty good blocks, but. Let's see, 50 stability? I don't know how good 50 stability is in this game. Eh, yeah, yeah, well. I think it increases, like, your item find or something. I think this makes me susceptible to invasions, maybe? Cathedral of Blue, huh? Huh. Well, what's behind this door? Well, I don't know, but find out in the next episode. Because uh, I actually do know, and I'm lying to you intentionally. I'm fire. Have a nice day.